at you can say these five broad area we have to work out to give the very productive result productive result means how much effort you are putting that effort should be productive otherwise what will happen people will get get demotivated you will get discouraged like i am putting much effort but result is not coming i am not getting that much that level of result why we are not getting one of the reason if we will analyze based on your past experience of any of the exam or maybe from your seniors or any of the colleagues or friend many of the times and many of the people we will work only on the visible syllabus invisible syllabus we are not working at all invisible syllabus we are just lifting on the luck luck will be there it will be managed but it is luck also may be there i am not uh, denying this is not there that uh, this is also there but how much we can do from our side how much we can do from our side that we will do which is beyond our control we will leave it then this five aspect of syllabus is there first is your what cat is check cat will check they will check they expect you should be very much analytical they are not expecting you should be well, like a systematic problem solver no that is for your learning for your learning process it is it must be if you will not learn systematically and process wise then your analytical skill will not develop then first criteria is analytical skill they are looking good analytical skill people who are going to clear the cat second is your comprehension skill these two broad skill they are looking and analytical skill you can divide quantitative and qualitative to check quantitative they are asking qa and di then you can say syllabus will be very flexible most of the questions if you will pick from cat exam then you will not able to find most of the question i am not telling all just suppose qa if you will take 30 questions if you will take 30 questions from any of the paper then uh, that 30 question you will you will able to solve 27 question or 26 question without helping of any direct formula syllabus is that much flexible because mainly they are focusing on your analysis analysis will be a kind of a skill that will be helpful for your problem solving and next is your and uh, next will check their qualitative skill based on that they are asking lr logical reasoning and next is your comprehension skill based on that they are asking varc and this is your visual syllabus these two are visual everybody will work on that every tutor every coaching institute every everybody will work on these two they will not work other things very effectively maybe they will tell so many things but they will not work very systematically and effectively one is your common sense that must be we have to work on that how to use and next to your time management and discipline for that i have given you a very good formula how to use it and next to your performance under pressure these three part are invisible syllabus these three part are invisible syllabus but you always keep in mind this is your part of syllabus you must prepare for that if you are not preparing systematically for this invisible part your visible part how much effort you have put maybe result will not come that level because this will be and finally we will think our luck was not good or this all luck maybe it will be there that will be it it is not in our control which is not in our control you leave it many factors are there life itself a big you can say miracle life itself a big miracle mean 99.9% things are not in our control not in control of human being we are thinking unnecessarily everything is in our control or many of the things we can control but i am telling if you will think as a vastness of the universe how much it is complex or how much it is vast how much it is big then you will find human being 99.9% things are not in our control but if you will feel as an individual then you can say just opposite way 99% thing you can control but this 99% we will see as a vastness of universe it will be 0.1% also not there then just try to understand this uh, analogy then uh, don't think about that part what we can do best you try to do it then time management this is we have to work and it, for that i have given very solid formula that formula it, you can say mathematically defined never forget in life never forget in life after too much experience and knowledge i derived this in mathematical way actually it is just in the form of you can say in the form of experience but how to make it a 
very you can say effective way due to why put in mathematical way 15 75 10 formula never forget never forget it will be useful throughout your life and i think one session i have explained very detail and who are a premium premium student i included in the video also how to prepare for uh, cat 21 performance under pressure that will make the difference you will go to abc or you may go to the baby i am so you may you have to compromise with other colleges this will be make this will make difference why we are taking pressure you just ask yourself simple simple solution simple solution no need to read plenty of books or no need to listen no need to see so many videos or many of the gurus or mahatmas no need to do only simply you ask why you are taking pressure some response will come some response will come our mind is just like a radio transmitter if you will ask something it will reply if you, you will ask how to go Delhi mind will reply if you will ask how to go London mind will reply if you will ask how to go I am Ahmedabad it will reply it will reply question cannot it cannot happen if you will ask something and you will not get reply maybe it will take some time few things immediate you want then immediate reply will come few things immediate cannot uh, answer will be there then you it will get, get some time just you ask yourself i'm making you self learner self capable no need to depend on anything you just ask yourself why i am taking pressure just you ask keep on ask within few days you will get some point afterwards you put again question mark once you are putting two to three step question mark you will get the real reason why you are taking pressure it will be a subjective issue not objective issue we can't say it is a very homogeneous way everybody is taking pressure because this we can't say we can't say everybody having different different uh, you can say neuron balancing and neuron uh, transmission system they are perceiving the things in different way the same figure if you will just put in uh, front of 10 different people 10 different 10 different people will analyze in different way depends on our neurotransmission how we are perceiving the image everything mind works works on only image image how to perceive the image then you ask why we are taking pressure what is the reason many of the times many of the times i am telling you one bitter truth many of the times we are trying to hide our weakness and that point of time to just cover that weakness we will show the pressure and we don't know that internally we are playing game with ourselves and under that pressure we will cover up our weakness and performance will be go down many of the times not only in exam many of the times in every walk of life you will realize and afterwards many reason can be many reason can be like uh, i will tell you one of the very you can say common reason who are preparing for cat especially i am telling not for uh, common people like uh, many many of the students are preparing from last three years they are not dedicatedly preparing only for cat they are working they are gaining the work experience but parallelly they are attempting cat but after attempting two or three attempt maybe two or three attempt result has not come good what will happen they will feel pressure why because they will compare with their previous records that is human tendency that is human tendency we are not coming outside from ourselves just we will compare last year i got 79 percent i learned only how this year i will get 95 this same question if it is coming in your mind anybody mind i am telling you very clear how to resolve this issue this same question you just ask in different way same question content will be same how i can get 95 percent this year you were asking last year was 79 only this year how will come 95 you are just demotivating yourself this same question you ask in different way how i can get 95 percent percentile this year how i can get 99 percentile this year how how i can get how i can get then these all region you have to analyze many of the people are having financial region like uh, they are preparing from last one two years they are invested something but results are not there they are in very you can say very fragile condition if this year also if uh, result is not good then my whatever i i invested money or whatever i spend money for preparation it will go best and i will not able to again uh, you can say uh, replan our career it may take again time many of the reason can be many of the reason you try to 
analyze and if it will be better you just try to write all the reasons just write why you are getting pressure some response will come keep one pocket diary always one sincere advice for me keep one pocket diary always anything is coming in mind you try to write it this is if you are started to maintain this one i am telling you many improvement will happen listing the problem itself will kill 20% problem listing the problems will kill 20% problem itself if you are able to make it list down this is most prominent this is most priority this is less priority this is urgent this is this is necessary